Hey everyone, welcome back. This is part 5 of Alan Wake 2 playthrough. Jump into it. So from what I read, at some point it splits into two different storylines. It's a pretty lengthy game in that way, I guess. I don't know, maybe not. But... I don't know if it's best to bounce around or just continue one playthrough first. From point of view, I guess you could say. Are you okay? Oh, no! It's my fault! They got out with my face! Scratch! Sir, calm down. I'm gonna need you to take a breath. It's... It's changed the story. The, the dark presence. We must stop it before... Easy now. First things first. What's your name? My name is Alan Wake. I'm a writer. I, I've been... Wake? Where did you come from? You've been missing for 13 years. 13? Where did you go? All of a sudden, the radio stopped working, and then that flooding just disappeared. You crazy forest. Is this who I think it is? Casey, say hello to Alan Wake. Mr. Wake, this is Special Agent Alex Casey. He'll escort you to our car. Casey, I'll meet you there, right after I take a look around. If the flooding's receded, there might be evidence we missed earlier. Okay. See you there. Okay, so... Alex Casey? How... Am I still... Is this the dark place? I guess we gotta investigate just this whole general area. Maybe some other spots. Yes, the PI from your Those who watched the previous part, obviously. Great. All of this we'll cutscene we we've already seen, but... should look around. With the flooding gone. Could be further clues out there. The flooding disappeared very suddenly. I wonder if there's any connection to the overlap to Nightingale. You can only technically stay within a certain area, right? Okay, I guess as long as I don't take the car back, I can't really go wrong in terms of where I'm exploring. So I can always, even if I don't find it right away, I can always find it at some point. I keep running around, but this looks to be the area I'm looking for. A locked box. Is that the puzzle? Cult of the tree symbol on it? Let me see what is. Let me see what happened. Get it now. 
Okay. There you go. Notes and ammo. Looks like they're tools of the trade. Oh, my weapons are reloaded, even though it's daytime and whatnot. So I should, hypothetically speaking, be okay, but never know. Let me see. Do I, what do I have for heals? Let me see. This is like the extent of what I can explore in this area. And I get around other foliage and whatnot. I guess not. Okay. Let's continue on then. towards a point of interest. Good to know. Do I put the heart in? I think it's empty now. Yeah, this area is a point of interest area right now. Wolf. No. I mean, this area is listed as a point of interest, but let's see what there's. Just if, if there's actually anything useful here. Just need to finish my sentence. <laughs> so I'm not mumbling. Anyways, uh, I think that's pretty much it there. Not even like I had a better idea what area was previously flooded to where I could explore and what wasn't. I technically don't have that it like objective completed yet, so really haven't done all of it. Here, ammo it looks like. These arrows point this way. Let's follow the arrows to where it leads. Stream side key. Cauldron Lake, interesting. I can find it. You gotta be a bit careful about getting on alive by animals and whatnot now. Okay. Anything interesting? Not really.
Ah, okay, stream side. So that's it right there. Unexplored area so far. That's what I have a key for now. I noticed that, yeah, stream side cauldron lake. There's something written here. It's by the area that I poem? didn't explore yet that or it wants written? me to investigate. Reminds me of the nursery rhymes I read to Logan when she was little. Let's see, I might have to jot some notes down here. I don't know if there's going to be like a pattern of some sorts that I have to follow, but. Might even be something that I have to come back to. I honestly don't think I have. I assume we need some sort of item that represents each one of these items, which I currently do not have. Also, let's open that up. See if we can add it to our case board. So we have a few items. Creepy dolls, mysterious rhymes. No weirder than anything else going on, I guess. Okay. We're at the Cauldron Lake right now, right? So. Oh wait, we need to look for a specific thing. We have dolls. Rhymes. There we go. Pieces. Cult stash. Should I did find a new cult stash? Hmm. What else do we have? Uh, Doesn't make sense. There we go. I think that might be it. Can I save inside of this area? I don't think so, right? The filing, open upgrade, which I don't think I have enough for map. Yeah, I don't think I can save in there. Let's look around. So I imagine that. Perfect weird souvenir for Logan. Maybe not an item to put down. I guess let's look around. Good. Where does this path continue to? Probably this way, right? Yep. Let's continue on. We'll find that chest or whatever the key is for the stash, and then also hopefully some other useful items and clues. Okay, I don't have whatever key I need for this one yet. Kind of check where I'm at, so. The private cabin on the right somewhere up the hill, I guess. Uh, yeah, I can't get there this way, I don't think. We'll have to come get to it the other way around. We might be able to go up here, though. It's here. That's kind of like a shortcut leading to the Witchfinder Station. Okay. Curious, like, how... The amount of clues that you find, how that impacts the story overall, or if there is like multiple endings, how does it impact the endings? Be interesting to Another figure out. Another one of those rhymes. Another one. Not quite sure yet what I'm gonna need to do for it. I'll try to explore as much as I can and then come back to it and get yeah, out. Okay, I don't know the password. I would imagine it's probably somewhere around the house. Look around. Let's see what's in the kitchen. Anything useful? I feel bad for these guys. Yeah, for anybody who hasn't played this game, I definitely, so far at least, where I played, I recommend it. Visually, it looks incredible. Story is pretty interesting so far.
I even have to go back and revisit the OG one. Probably play the remastered version this time around, but Let's see anything useful here. Doesn't seem like it. Let me see as well. We have a couple more items I can add to the case board here, so. doll hero doll okay it's those are items we actually will need for whatever that puzzle is so I'm still curious though. If, oh, this is something of use. Uh, I'm still curious though. Do we need all of the items to complete the puzzle, or if we only need a couple? And then maybe the rhyme only mentions like a few of them that you have to place in the right spot. Also, I'm not sure where the code is. It would be upstairs maybe, but I haven't seen anything yet that points me in the right direction. It's computer. Didn't see anything upstairs, I didn't see anything downstairs looked in every room maybe there's something outside but oh there's like this little storage room thing laundry room maybe see what this says okay Not really help me with the code. The computer. Unless I'm stupid. Hmm. Let me go back real quick. This is just straight up the digit code. Yeah, I don't you not know. Oh, I'm I'm stupid, guys. Don't don't mind me. Is that is that it? Two five words. There we go. Nice. Should have looked. It's actually. I mean, if not if you're not really looking for it, it does kind of blend in a little bit because of the color. Like it kind of not blends in, but gets kind of washed out a bit, so you don't really notice it. But yeah. What does this say again? So, brave hero. Of home from the woods came the wolf. Something feels different. I should look around. 
What is this? Oh, damn. I was strong feeling there's going to be a jump scare coming up at some point here. that Logan made for me. Huh. That was strange. Gotta keep an eye out for more of these rhymes. I think the item is back. I can do the next one. I'll have to go back to the one in the beginning at some point here. But yeah. Anyways, uh, let's also check out the case board. I might have a couple more items I can put on there. Yep. So... The FBC is definitely playing with things they don't fully understand. And that always goes well. Are you exploring? Then we can go towards the stream side. To figure out where to stack. Actually, wait. Uh, uh, when I go out the back door, there might be a path that way as well. What else do we have here? A manuscript, maybe? Yep, indeed we do. Check it out. An overlap of the dark place needed a push from both directions to manifest itself. Reality in our world eroded by repeated dark lore tied to a location and a counterpoint. A work of art, a horror narrative crafted in the depths of the dark place, connecting to the story on the other side to reach out through the weakened veil. A story of a lawman whose heart was cut out of his chest. Two corrupt men killed by their own twisted ambition. A haunted old woman drowned in a bathtub. Twisted reflections on the other side of the mirror. Arcs stabbing through realities, amplifying the influence of the dark place. These elements working in conjunction made a trickle that became a torrent, a wormhole, a vortex. And the art, the map, became the nightmare territory where the dark place encroached on our reality. A blanket over it where they all overlapped, causing reality to twist and loop like a bad dream, remolding anything and anyone within its dark horror design. Okay. Uh, just thinking, let me look behind the house. Does this lead to, so this was the back door, right? Does this actually lead to anything? Or is it just kind of a dead end? It might just be a dead end, okay. In that case, we'll continue exploring. You've reached the car, Anderson. How's it going down there? I think I'm done here. I'll meet you at the parking lot. I've been thinking more about the cult of the tree. What sort of cult refers to themselves as a cult? They don't. We're not seeing the full picture yet. There's another lunchbox.
for it to like knock it down because isn't that like one of the items I need for for this puzzles? How do I get it down here? Pretty sure one of the puzzles mentioned. The puzzles meant or had an image of a house on it, didn't it? Back here. Okay, this is a house. Okay, yeah. I think if I shoot like the little ring on it or something, I can drop, but apparently not. I can't use the key on either of these. So, let me go back to the first, uh, this would be worth checking that out. Well, actually, there's a private cabin. I don't think I've been to that private cabin, have I? I get there. Let me check. That might be this thing up here, right? Which I think there's a path around the corner. I check that out first. I already lose track of it, maybe. I don't know. Wait, let me read this thing again, too. Figure out how to get to that private cabin. On the corner this way, right? Could be where I could use that key. There's a rhyme over here. Another puzzle here, actually. So, crow, and then hero. Curious if, I, if there's like two doll, uh, crow dolls or something. Let me check. Gun side of here, yeah. Look around.
Okay, there we go. I have a weird feeling something's changed. Children in Bright Falls all grew up hearing stories about the cult of the tree. Feral maniacs living in the woods. Satanists chanting, we watch in the night as they perform blood sacrifices in the forest. Or things not quite human lurking in the dark. There were many versions of the story, but they all shared one important element. Danger in the dark, in the woods. Somewhere among all the urban legends lay a secret truth. The real identity of the cultists prowling in the woods. Real faces hid behind the masks. Real hands held the knives. Real people fulfilling a grim purpose. The forest was not safe. People were right to keep their children away from the trees. Guys, I actually might end this part here. It's a pretty good stopping point. Now that I was able to finally actually save the game. The next part we'll try to figure out where uh, the key is for those two boxes if I can't even find it right now. I'll try to find the chest that I can actually open with my key that I found. And maybe try to solve that last puzzle. So, But yeah, thank you for watching. We'll catch you in the next one.